to get video of me driving. Yeah, I can't really see much because it's darkening. Uh, I guess. There we go. That's a good shot. You see how much clearer it looks? Mm -hmm. Can you see that? Can you see the car? Yep. All right. This is the Ofna. Running on four cells. So I got it working, obviously. Converted it from gas to electric. And, uh, that's full throttle. There's full throttle for you. go that's with the uh, hobby wing XR8 150 amp ESC and the 2250 kilovolt motor uh, four cell lipo 50c so it looks to me like it's doing let's say what what do you think Caitlin about 40 about maybe a little less I guess if you put it at full throttle constantly, it'd be like, what, 45? I can't see it over there. Can't see it because it's not in Nah. There's a parking lot there. Mm-hmm. Ooh, 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 I got a that wheel. wheel collapsing. Uh-oh. <laughs> wheel. This wheel. Yikes. Yeah, it's coming off. <laughs> Oops. Gotta re-glue that one. Okay, no more speed runs with these tires. Yep. Uh-oh. Yeah, this is an old Ofna, like uh, Ultra LX1 or LX2. I'm not even sure which one it was, but I converted it. This is the Ofna. I converted it to electric mm. by hand, the hard way. And uh, oh, I need, need better uh, battery battery straps here. I need to shorten these so they hold properly. Go to here you can see the 150 amp ESC. There's the 2250 kilovolt motor. And uh, so I had to put in this motor mount aftermarket. I had to buy the battery or the controller tray and the servo tray, battery tray, ESC. And then I had to get a new um, uh, rear stabilizer. And everything else is pretty much factory except if I replace the bearings in most everything. And I kept all the same drive axles and transaxles. Had to rework the gears inside the center diff because they were all chewed up. Everything else is uh, stock. <laughs>